Submarines in the Great Lakes, unveiling the depths of naval history. Beneath the tranquil surface of the Great Lakes, a shadowy presence stirs. Submarines, those silent hunters of the deep, navigate these inland waters, their purposes shrouded in secrecy. Why here, one wonders. The first known instance of a submarine in these freshwater expanses whispers tales of adventure and intrigue. The waters hold secrets, echoing with the silent glide of a vessel unseen. Then there's the journey of UC-97, a tale that feels more like a ghost story than history. A German U-boat, surfacing from the depths of WWI, finds its way into these peaceful waters. How? The question lingers like mist on the lake. Navigational routes into the Great Lakes are complex, veiled in mystery. These pathways, known to few, guide steel giants through the labyrinth of water and time, a hidden dance beneath the waves. And at the heart of it all lies the St. Lawrence Seaway, the gateway for these underwater emissaries. Its role is pivotal, yet it holds its secrets close, a keeper of the deep unknown. Beneath the tranquil surface of the Great Lakes, shadows move in silence. Detection and monitoring efforts are shrouded in secrecy, with technology peering into the depths to uncover the unseen. Navigational routes into these inland seas are known only to a select few. Whispered tales speak of hidden pathways, enabling steel giants to slip in unnoticed, challenging the imagination. The St. Lawrence Seaway, a gateway cloaked in mystery, stands as a testament to human engineering. Yet it also serves as a conduit for silent visitors, its role pivotal, yet enigmatic. Concerns linger about the unseen impact these visitors have on the pristine waters. The environmental risks posed by submarines are debated in hushed tones, with potential repercussions lurking beneath the waves. Economies teeter on the brink as the silent giants navigate the Great Lakes, their presence a double-edged sword. The balance between benefit and detriment remains a closely guarded secret. Beneath the tranquil waters of the Great Lakes, an unseen presence stirs, casting ripples across the surface of local economies. Submarines, silent and secretive, navigate these inland seas, their missions obscured by the depths. The impact of their passage extends beyond the water, touching the shores of industry and tourism. Questions linger about the consequences of their covert journeys. Amidst the murky waters, an awareness grows among the people. The silent giants below do not just pass. They influence, weaving a narrative of curiosity and caution. Communities along the lakeshore, once oblivious, now ponder the significance of these hidden voyagers. The information shared is scant, leaving speculation to fill the voids of understanding. The depths of the Great Lakes conceal more than natural wonders. They hold stories, artifacts, and mysteries unlocked by the advent of submarine exploration. Maritime archaeologists, aboard these modern vessels, dive into the past, uncovering tales long swallowed by the waves. Each discovery adds a chapter to the rich history of these inland seas, offering glimpses into epics and events that shaped the region. An opportunity for connection emerges, as submarines become conduits between the public and the deep. Tours and exhibitions offer a peek into the once inaccessible world beneath the waves, bridging the gap between the surface and the depths. These experiences, rare and coveted, invite intrigue and admiration, drawing crowds eager to glimpse the mysteries of the deep. Yet the horizon holds more. The potential of submarines in the Great Lakes stretches into the realms of research and defense, promising advancements yet unseen. This evolving relationship between mankind and machine, navigating the freshwater seas, hints at a future where the mysteries of the Great Lakes are not just explored, but embraced, marking a new chapter in the storied waters of the inland seas. Submerged beneath the tranquil surface of the Great Lakes, submarines encounter a realm far different from the salty depths of the oceans. Freshwater environments pose unique challenges, testing the limits of naval engineering. The absence of buoyant salt water demands precise adjustments, ensuring submarines don't become entangled in the underwater landscapes shaped by millennia. Collaboration whispers through the waters as nations bordering these vast lakes unite. Secrets of successful navigation and technological mastery are shared in hushed tones, forging unseen alliances.
This underwater diplomacy ensures that the murky depths remain navigable, safeguarding the delicate balance between exploration and preservation. Deep beneath the waves, submarines transform into classrooms, their crews engaging in rigorous training exercises. The Great Lakes, a seemingly serene backdrop, become stages for intricate simulations, preparing sailors for missions cloaked in secrecy. Here, in these freshwater depths, the future of underwater navigation is written. Communities lining the shores feel the ripples of these hidden giants. Whispers of fleeting shadows passing beneath the waves stir curiosity and concern. The presence of these silent visitors weaves a complex tapestry of intrigue and wonder, binding the fate of those above to those below. In the quiet aftermath, the significance of submarines in the Great Lakes lingers like a mystery unsolved. Further investigation calls, promising revelations that lie just beneath the surface, waiting to be unearthed. The depths hold stories yet to be told, beckoning those brave enough to delve into the unknown.